Greetings and welcome to this headline briefing on car news. This hour's concentration is on the design, manufacture, interior construction and delivery of the 2024 Arter. Now let's get going. Makers of the world's first solar electric vehicle, Atera Motors, have raised $33 million by giving prospective early adopters the chance to secure a spot in the first 2,000 vehicles to be produced. The company recently said that the Accelerator program, which collected over $33 million to finance the first stages of the production of its Aptera solar electric vehicle, CEV, had been completed successfully. Launched in January 2023, Aptera's Accelerator program allowed interested parties to secure a reservation place for one of the company's first 2000 launch edition vehicles for a minimum investment of $10,000 USD. The Aptera CV has one of the most energy-dense battery packs on the market, an efficient drivetrain, revolutionary two-axis automotive-grade solar panels, and extreme aerodynamics and a low-drag coefficient so optimum power consumption. With its 400-mile, about 645 km, range on a single charge, the Aptera Launch Edition is fitted with about 700 W of solar cells, which the company estimates will produce an extra 40 miles, 65 kilometers, every day. With dollar US 33 million under its belt, Aptera claims to have obtained the funds required to finance its first stages of production. To be more precise, the company's first production intent vehicles will be built and low volume tooling acquired through the successful accelerator program will be utilized for testing and validation. Following the successful validation of Aptera's production intent vehicles, the company plans to seek money to source tooling and equipment for high volume production, which it claims will require 10 times less resources than those required by conventional manufacturers. Chris Anthony, co-founder and co-CEO of Aptera, remarked, We were amazed by the overwhelming support from thousands of prospective Aptera owners when we first launched Aptera as a solar mobility company. We are committed to obtaining the remaining funds needed for scalable, high-volume production of our solar EV, with over 46,000 reservation holders. Our solar mobility movement is revolutionizing the way game-changing concepts are realized. In order to guarantee a beneficial impact on our society and the environment, not only how they are funded, but also how communities are developed around them. The business keeps forming connections with suppliers, honing designs to increase productivity, and acquiring tools and equipment for production. For pre-orders, the firm is presently taking deposits of $100. These down payments are reimbursed in full. We plan to begin delivering on these pre-orders in the second quarter of 2024. Our pre-order cancellation rate is currently less than 5%. We currently have 43,000 pre-orders as of July 14, 2023. We expect to be able to fulfill the pre-orders in 2027. Our projected first deliveries on these pre-orders are scheduled for Q2 of 2024. By 2025, we expect to produce 7,000 cars annually. And by 2026, we expect to produce 20,000 cars annually. The aforementioned numbers are contingent upon our ability to raise a sizable sum of money because a sizable portion of our pre-orders have access to the commodities and materials needed to construct the vehicles have manufacturing facilities available, and have continuous supply chains. Assuming 1,000 will occur in 2024, that's next suppose 7,000 in 2025, and 20,000 in 2026, as planned. Further assumptions, by the end of the following few months, after the non-accredited investors are permitted to re-enter, let's say there will be 2,000 accelerator orders and 45,000 pre-orders. Extra suppositions, Suppose that 30% of typical pre-orders and 80% of accelerator investors end up buying a car in full. Assume that 75% of typical pre-order buyers and 90% of accelerator investors reside in the United States or Canada. Thus, there are 1,440 complete orders for accelerator vehicles in the United States and Canada, and slightly more than 10,000 initial full orders. Out of the 10,000, a portion will be LE and a portion other configurations. Assume that 50% are LE or 5K. 
Thus, Q3 2024 will cover a small number of accelerator vehicles, while Q4 2024 will cover the remaining vehicles in January and February of 2025. Those in the USA who place pre-orders for LE should receive them by the end of 2025. Q4 2025 should see the emergence of the first non-LE variants, with the remaining ones following in 2026. The first pre-order delivery to other countries are likely to occur in 2026. And by then, a number of non-pre-ordered orders should have also been placed, once people start to see them around. With its cutting-edge solar electric vehicle, SEV, which aims to redefine the limits of efficiency in the automobile industry, Actora Motors has been attracting attention. We learned a wealth of information about the painstaking design and production procedures that went into creating this groundbreaking SEV from the recent interview that Actora Chief of Design Jason Hill conducted on the Actora Owners Club YouTube channel. Let's examine the specifics that demonstrate Actora's dedication to excellent design, regulatory compliance, and practical engineering. Jason Hill traveled to Italy with the intention of improving Attera's production capacity, not only to enjoy pasta and espresso. His partnership with CPC and ETP in Turin is essential, since these partners have a great deal of experience with composite processes, which is essential for creating Attera's robust and lightweight vehicle body. The bodies are made in Italy and then transported to California for final assembly, perhaps by sea. And delivery is just not cost-effective, even though it would be faster. When customs processing is taken into account, a sea voyage takes about two weeks. This illustrates Aptera's commitment to striking a balance between economy and efficiency. Before we go any further though, would you kindly support this channel by liking it and clicking the subscribe button below. By doing so, You'll be allowing YouTube to know what you like and enabling yourself to receive new video updates as they are posted on this channel. I'm grateful. Now let's move forward. From the sturdy rear license plate lights that complies with regulations without producing light pollution to the side rear view mirrors that combine functionality with cutting edge camera systems. Every element of Aptera's design has been painstakingly thought out. Aptera Solar Car. With a 1000 mile range, Aptera is previewing a new, minimalist cabin for its most recent solar electric car prototype. Efficiency of electric vehicles attracts a lot of people, and Aptera's solar electric vehicle, SEV, is the most efficient vehicle available. With a drive coefficient, CD, of just 0.13, and a three-wheel design that makes it incredibly light, the Aptera SEV can travel 250 miles on a relatively small battery pack and 1,000 miles on larger battery packs. An experienced manufacturer of electric cars, Aptera never saw much success with its initial ideas. However, it has come back strong with a new design that is currently accepting orders. It's crucial that the car lives up to its ridiculous efficiency claims. Its ability to have solar panels installed with the claim that it will never charge is more of a gimmick than a true feature. In actuality, Installing solar panels on a car is not at all environmentally friendly. Let us begin with the positive. Aptera claims that because of the vehicle's streamlined and aerodynamic three-wheel design, it requires just 100 watt-hours to cover a mile. Contrast that with the already incredibly efficient Tesla TSLA 2.4% Model 3, which uses 250 watt-hours, or larger electric cars, which can reach that distance with 300 or even 400 watt-hours. Although it involves some trade-offs, that is a tremendous feat and an astoundingly efficient use of resources. With that efficiency, the vehicle could run for a very long time using the same batteries used in standard EV sedans. The Aptera has a range of 250 miles on a battery similar to that of an earlier Leaf, while the version with a 100 kilowatt-hours battery, similar to that of a Tesla Model X, can drive nearly 1,000 miles on a single charge. Although it creates the possibility of road excursions in distant areas not otherwise appropriate for EVs, that is essentially a useless amount of range because nobody can probably drive more than 600 miles in a day without becoming tired. There is another use for so much battery, which we will discuss below. 
While solar power has only been used to counter vampire drain or add a few miles of range to electric vehicles, Atterra's electric car is so efficient that it can add up to 40 miles of range per day by simply parking it outside. With a starting price of just $25,000, this is enough to generate a lot of buzz. Due to the high demand for this car and its specifications, the business is able to secure over 22,000 bookings. To reserve the solar electric car, Aptera requires a $100 deposit or $70 if you use a referral code. It displays an extremely tidy and understated cabin that is similar to that of the Tesla Model 3 slash Roy. It has a center display in addition to an instrument cluster screen. Aptera must contend with the constraints imposed by the vehicle's size, which must undoubtedly be smaller in order to attain the level of efficiency it seeks, as well as the freedom that comes from not being categorized as a car, but rather, depending on the jurisdiction, as a motorbike or autocycle. The company plans to put its solar electric vehicle into production by the end of the year and is anticipated to completely reveal its Gamma prototype later this week. And with that, we wrap things up for the time being. I hope you enjoyed the video. See you in the next video.